Let's do the US Open now. Okay. And we have two new champions at the US Open. Mm. Oh. Um, in the women's um, game, it was Iga Swantek. She's world number one. She won her third Grand Slam, her first at the US Open. She beat Ons Jaber. Ons Jaber is Tunisian. Um, she's, this is her second successive um, Grand Slam defeat. She lost in the final at Wimbledon. She's come to lose again in the final at US Open. Ons Jaber. When will you win? <laughs> Uh, at least she's made it to the final. The fi she should have been the final. Eh. At least. Yeah. At least. Uh, if you know you win, then as an individual. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> everything's not about not winning. Not as part of a team. No, everything's as an not individual. about winning. Ah. It's not all about winning. Is he? It's because of what is happening. He, he That's set, why. He's setting the stage. Eh? He's, he knows what is going on. His team is not winning. So it's, it's, it's not all about winning. But in the men's draw, it was Carlos Alcaraz. A 19-year-old mm. sensation. He won his first Grand Slam. He's now the youngest ever Grand Slam um, champion since Nadal in 2005. He's brilliant. Oh. Yes, 19-year-old. Um, um, he's had a lot of potential, mm. but we're waiting for when he'll make that big step. And now he's made it. Um, he beat um, Root in the final um, in four sets. It was a, quite a convincing game from him. So yes, he's US Open champion. His first Grand Slam at 19 years. The sky is the limit for him. But in Australia. When the big boys come around, you know this one, Federer was in there, Nadal was on one leg, Djokovic was in there. So when the big boys come to Australia, that's when you see his smoothness level. Yeah. So Carlos Alcaraz, just know that the big boys are coming around. You see, I like to address them in the eye, look yeah. them in the eye. Yeah, we can see that. Yeah.